And here we are back in Citadel Forged with Fire. Uh, and we're going to start off with some crafting in this episode. So let's head indoors. Now, my plan very, 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 very shortly is to go and try and tame a drake a flying dragon type thing. And so I'm going to need quite a lot of mana for that. And I can now make a plus three mana ring. But that requires five amethyst crystals. So in the forge, amethyst crystals require precious stone and light essence. So we've got that. So let's craft those. And whilst those are crafting, we'll have a look at broomsticks. Now we've already got the traveller's broomstick, but we can make a daredevil's broomstick. Goodness knows what difference that is. And there you go. So we shall craft one of those. I think that's all I need, to be honest. And then the next thing we're going to craft is some more of these staffs, or staves. Uh, so we can make the valance, well, the valance staffs. And we're going to make quite a lot of those. And see if we can get one or two even with some decent, um, with some decent boosts on them. But we'll have to wait for it to finish making the broomstick first. How's this getting on? That's got a ways to go. There's something making a noise outside. It's a bear. Now I'm not sure if I've mentioned, but you'll notice the absence of Boris the bear. Unfortunately, Boris died. Oh, there's a birdie. Birds have a tremendous amount of loot on them for not much effort. So killing birds is worth an idea. Now. So yes, we've lost Boris, but we're going to try and tame a, a dragon instead. Now my plan is to build a castle, possibly on one of those two knolls over there. So we're still quite close to the the fast travel place. And I don't know, but it may be possible to build a a walkway between the knoll and the mainland. We'll have a go at some point. At some point well in the future. Now this building is five by five. It's five blocks square. Now what I want to do is make the, the stone building, or at least the initial part of it, um, bigger. So I'm thinking 7 by 7. So 49 blocks. And that's going to consume some stone. I've got nearly 4,000 stone. I reckon the floor alone will probably take about 3,000 stone. So the ceiling will take about 3,000 stone. And the walls, I think, will take about 4,000 stone. And then we probably need one or 2,000 stone just for, you know, mistakes and stuff like that. So I probably need somewhere in the region of ten to 12,000 stone. That is a lot of stone. Uh, yeah. So we'll get on with doing that in a minute. Now, press E to loot. We have a Daredevil's broomstick. 910 flight speed. Okay. So now we've got that. Now then, hang on. Oh, I can't check on the forge. We'll have to wait for the forge to finish and make the ring, and then we'll start making the, the staves. So I haven't actually um, flown on a broomstick on camera yet. So... That's the standard broomstick. Wow. That looks much better, doesn't it? 
So we shall equ equip that. And when you go for fly, this is what it looks like. There we go. That's pretty impressive, isn't it? What, what, what's not to love about flying on a broomstick? So this over here, you can see how that's chewing through the manor there. I mean, good grief, look at that go. So this here is where I am thinking... Ooh, ...of making a base. There's an unpleasant neighbour. He's a bit of a crouchy fellow, isn't he? Doesn't really pose a serious threat to me, though. There we go. So, yeah. That's possibly the location for my um, next build. And I'm only just going to make it back to land, aren't I? <laughs> it really does chew through your mana like nobody's business. So let's put our ring back on. Because you can't wear a ring and use a broomstick. I have no idea why. It is possible, or it was before the last update, to find clothing items or staffs or staves that um, have mana regeneration on them. In which case the ring becomes less important. We've got the amethyst crystals. If I can target the loot bag. There we go. So let's make the next level of ring. So we'll set that off. And we'll go to weapons. The Valance Staffs. And 9 seems a bit excessive. Uh, yeah. Let's go with 6. And set that off crafting. Oh, don't cancel now. So those are all going to take a little while. So I'll just bring you back when uh, when they're done. So we'll see you very shortly. So let's see what we've managed to make. If I can interact with this bag. A dignified magic ring. Yep. Plus three mana per second. Ah, now this ring doesn't give me extra mana. My level two ring gives me 89 mana. Mm. Mm. Let's see what the staffs do. The staves do. Staff, stave, there. Oh wow, all of those, we've only got one halfway decent one. Let's loot them all and have a look. So we've got one that's got extra critical. That's got extra critical. Bit of mana, extra critical. Uh, but a lot less damage. Yeah. Uh, critical. Critical in mana, but a lot less damage. What's this one? More damage, slightly less mana, health, and critical chance. Hmm. So actually the first one we made was alright. This is the only one that comes close to it. That's a bit disappointing. Uh, have I got a chest I can put those in? Um, possibly this one? How much do they weigh? 6.7 kilos. Yeah, they're gonna... Take up a load of weight. 
Hmm. No, I think I need the extra um, mana regeneration. Oh, didn't mean to do that. More than I need. Where did it go to put it in there? I need the mana regeneration more than I need the, uh, the extra mana. Do I? Yes, I do. So that's what we'll do. And next episode, we will go out and we will get ourselves a drake. Yeah. Or we'll try, anyway. <laughs> so we'll see you then. Bye for now.